an under 23 100 meter silver medalist in the relay. And Thrall Kimmins of the USA. Best this year, 10 0 2. We'll go to the Olympics as part of the 4 by 100 meter relay squad. The grand old man of sprinting, Kim Collins, 36 years old now, former world champion way back in 2003, said to become the first man ever to compete in five Olympic Games as a 100 meter sprinter. Next to Collins, Tyson Gay, the former world champion at 100 and 200 meters. And the world can't wait to see him line up against the likes of Usain Bolt, Johan Blake and the Saka Power. Fastest man in the field for the time of 9.86 this year. Kemar Hyman and the Cayman Islands has reduced his lifetime best from 10.14 down to 9.95 this year. He really is an exciting athlete. Very exciting, Michael Freighter, former World Championship silver medalist over 100 metres, 9.94 this year. That's in lane 8, Jack Harvey, 23 years old, Wall Student Games champion last year. Another very, very good Jamaican. 10-0 this season, but could only finish in 8th place in the Jamaican National Championships, such as the depth of sprinting in Jamaica. Very interested to see Kmar Hyman just to the right of Tyson Gay, but Tyson Gay certainly starting here as favourite is customary point towards the heavens and luckily for him at the moment the heavens are not opening the track is actually drying out just a little bit 10.06 was the time of the winner in the first heat Dwayne Chambers still sitting on a 10.35 blocking as the second fastest loser at the moment. So the first three and the two fastest losers from both heats go through. And Tyson Gay, a little bit slow to get away. Kim Collins is going well, right on the inside, 12. Kim Evans, but here comes Tyson Gay. Tyson Gay may just have got it. 12 Kim Evans was certainly flying. But that was a pedestrian start by one of the fastest men in the world, Tyson Gay. And luckily his second 50 was very strong indeed. Colin. His second 50 is always very strong in your right there, Paul. But you know, Terrell Kimmons was in lane two. And of course, the other man we were looking at was Michael Freighter, I think. That's between Tyson, Michael Freighter, and Kimmons, they were the guys. But as you say, Tyson really was quite pedestrian. He ambled up the blocks, he didn't get into his pickup very well indeed, and then he really had to work in the final 50. He managed to do that, he starts to pull himself in to the contention position but Michael Freighter, closest to us in the camera, in grey, takes the victory. You see that? Yep, it's definitely Freighter first.